I know worrying is no use, but I still I I'm worried. How do I stop my worry? I give you four ways to stop your worries. Okay, the first thing is this: whenever you are worried, no, this is not the first time you are worrying. You have been worrying last year, year before that. Almost every, maybe every month, you worried for this or that. There was rumor in the year 2000, computers will crash, and then the electricity will go off, food won't be available, and California is going to go under the water. There was no cell phones in those days, mind you, and many people from California. were in such anxiety and tension they want to leave california and would go and want to settle in colorado we were traveling from coast to coast from from san diego to vancouver i went around assuring people look none of those things are going to happen 2000 will come and the world is not going to end you don't have to panic on it so This is not the first time you are worrying. You have worried in the past. Just this reminder will give you strength for this moment. And it was futile exercise that you worried and wasted so much of time and collected so much toxins in your body. And it's not worth it. Knowing anyway, one day everything is going to go down. The curtain is going to come down. So what? Let it be. So that's one thing. Second is. whatever your problem you think you have now you have the strength to overcome that invoke the valor in you think i will be able to take this challenge so when you don't feel the strength within you to face a challenge that's when you worry but when you know you have the strength you have done it in the past you can do it now that valor will see you through the challenge that you face Number two, number three, and the best is breathing, pranayama, kriya, meditation. That will just help you snap out of this uh, the worry mindset. Okay, worry big. See, when your worry is small, that bothers you. But if you if you are determined to worry, I would say worry big. What will happen to this planet or in two hundred years from now? The big worries doesn't take your sleep away, but small worries will bother you. So you have to expand and extend your worries. If at all you are so fond of your worries, I would say make them big, give them some booster dose, feed well your worries. Don't worry only for yourself. Worry for everybody around you. What will happen? You know how everybody will get their food in another ten years. We are consuming one and half times what the Earth is can provide us. If it continues like that, one day it will be totally depleted. So what will happen then? These sort of big worries will also take you away from small. And then look at people who have bigger challenges than you. That will also subside your worry.